Known for its iconic sights and a wealth of history, Washington DC is a unique place to visit in the US. This is Katie from Creative Travel Guide and today we share 10 reasons to visit Washington DC. Looking for more travel tips? Make sure to hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. So the first reason is the historical landmarks. The main reason that people will head to Washington DC is to see the iconic historical landmarks located here. Of course, you will need to see the White House. This is a must-see watch right here, but also head up the Washington Monument, visit the memorials, and then head to the Capitol building. Washington DC is home to some fascinating diverse museums. The Smithsonian Museums are world-class museums that you must visit whilst in Washington. The National Air and Space Museum features iconic artifacts like the Wright Brothers plane and the Apollo 11 command module. Families can delve into the history of the natural world at the National Museum of Natural History, and art lovers can head to the Smithsonian American Art Museum, admiring a vast collection of American art spanning from colonial times to contemporary pieces. Although not technically part of the Smithsonian, the National Gallery of Art is also an impressive museum to head to, and then you can head to the National Museum of African American History and Culture. Washington DC is home to several significant memorials, which is another reason people choose to visit here. Firstly, you can head to the Lincoln Memorial, an iconic seated statue of Abraham Lincoln, which pays tribute to the 16th president. Not too far from here is the Vietnam Veterans Memorial, a powerful tribute to the men and women who served and sacrificed during the Vietnam War. And not far from that is the Korean War Veterans Memorial too. Located on the National Mall is the World War II Memorial, remembering the millions of Americans who served during World War II. You could also visit the Jefferson Memorial commemorating Thomas Jefferson, the third President of the United States, and also head to the Martin Luther King Jr. Memorial, a striking monument dedicated to the civil rights leader. Which brings us on to our next reason to visit Washington is for the politics. As the home of the US President and Congress, there are various political sites that you could visit whilst you're here. Of course, you can visit the outside of the White House, an iconic building in the US, but we also recommend heading into the United States Capitol building, home to the US Congress. You could choose to take a guided tour to learn more about the legislative process and history of this impressive building, but if you wish to do so, make sure to book those tickets in advance. You could also visit the Library of Congress, the largest library in the world, and then visit the National Archives, home to the original copies of the US Constitution, the Declaration of Independence and the Bill of Rights. If you can time your visit to Washington DC just right, you can enjoy the Cherry Blossom Festival. Every spring, Washington transforms into a stunning, picturesque place to explore, full of cherry blossoms around the tidal basin. This creates a beautiful pink and white landscape that makes for gorgeous photographs and it's just one more reason to visit, especially in the spring. Another reason to visit is for the zoo. The Smithsonian Zoo shares a wide variety of wildlife and is part of the Smithsonian Institution, meaning it is free to visit. Don't miss the giant pandas, a star attraction at the zoo, but also explore the Great Ape House and the Elephant Trails. Washington DC has a vibrant performing arts scene. If this is your thing, head to the Kennedy Center for Performing Arts, a major hub for arts showcasing a range of performances from ballet to theater to orchestra concerts. Check what performances are on during your visit and again, as always, make sure to book tickets in advance. Another reason to visit Washington is for the neighborhoods. Washington DC is home to a diverse range of neighborhoods, each with its own unique character. Georgetown is a historic charming neighborhood full of cobblestone streets and upscale shopping opportunities. Capitol Hill is known for its political and residential areas, whilst Adams Morgan is a diverse neighborhood full of thriving nightlife and dining options. And then we have the nearby attractions. Yes, there are plenty of things to see and do in Washington DC itself, but there are also various historic landmarks and attractions on the outskirts of Washington DC. These can be visited for a few hours or for a whole day trip. 
within walking distance from Washington DC is Arlington National Cemetery, a picturesque iconic cemetery home to notable figures such as JFK. George Washington's historic state home called Mount Vernon is also not too far from Washington DC, whilst Harpers Ferry in West Virginia and Annapolis in Maryland make for great day trips. Just a 35 minute drive from Washington DC is the Great Falls Park in Virginia, which is a breathtaking natural area to explore. You could also visit the Gettysburg National Military Park in Pennsylvania. This is around a two hour drive from DC, but is a perfect opportunity for those history enthusiasts that want to learn more about the Civil War. Another reason to visit Washington DC is for the food scene. From food trucks to upscale dining, there really is a vast range of food available in Washington DC. Known for its blue crabs, oysters and oversized pizza slices, there is plenty of great food to try whilst you're in Washington. You could also head to Chinatown for some great dining options, as well as Georgetown for some more upscale options. Watch this video to find out the things to know before you go to Washington DC, then to learn about the 10 best free things to do in Washington DC, watch this video. We hope you have an incredible time and stay creative.